Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Sheldon here again. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button right down below. Today I'm going to take a look at a keyboard that's supposed to reduce stress on your hands, your wrists, and also stop muscle strain for people who spend a long time at their computer. This is the KE68 ergonomic keyboard from Jellico. This ergonomic wireless keyboard is a lower cost but similar to the very popular yet expensive Logitech K860. Shout out to Jellycomb for sending me this keyboard so I can give an honest review. So let's unbox, set up, and test the Jellycomb K E68 ergonomic keyboard. So this keyboard comes from a company that prides itself on bringing innovation and efficient office and home equipment for work and life. They are best known for their keyboards and mice and go by Jellycomb. So opening up the box of my first ergonomic keyboard, let's see what we got. First, we got the keyboard and then the USB charging cable. Taking a look at the plastic wrap sealed bag is the Jellycomb KE68 itself. Inside the bag with the keyboard is a warranty activation card and a multilingual user manual. Then we got a split designed ergonomic keyboard itself which is designed to position your wrist into a more natural position than most standard keyboards. This wireless keyboard actually has four folding stands on the underside. With most keyboards only having two on the top, this is a good feature that allows you to tent the keyboard three or five degrees for even more personalization and comfort while typing. Also on the underside is the on off button and a handy spot to store the 2.4 gigahertz nano receiver for wireless connectivity. Speaking of connectivity, this Jellycomb KE68 keyboard can be connected wirelessly through the dongle or through two different Bluetooth switches as shown by the three buttons on the keyboard. And it's able to connect to three separate devices such as your laptop, TV, computer, etc. at the same time and can be switched between them with one single click. So an ergonomic keyboard usually separates a standard keyboard layout into two halves splitting the keys in half roughly around the center of the keyboard and slightly tilting each half in a way that promotes a more natural hand and wrist position. When typing, this should reduce joint and muscle strain on the body. The KE68 comes with a comfortable pillowed wrist rest made of synthetic leather that was comfortable and welcome as I use this keyboard in my full-time job. The Ergo keyboard has natural art keys that are supposed to mimic the curved shape of your fingertips and I found this to be a nice feature that really made them pleasant and comfortable to tap on. However, they don't light up, which was a little bit disappointing. And another odd feature is the keyboard only had one control key on the left side instead of the two control keys that most standard keyboards have. The KE68 comes with a ton of multimedia function buttons on top of the keyboard that are compatible with the three operating systems this keyboard works with, Windows, Apple, and Android. This keyboard has a very Mac friendly layout, so users coming from that platform should have no issues with it. With the included USB-C charging cable, which is really nice to see, this keyboard has a 280 milliamp lithium battery, which will give you 200 hours standby time with an auto sleep function after 30 minutes of non-use. Charging time is between two and three hours, whereas the power indicator will turn from red to green when fully charged. I used this keyboard. It lasted me a couple of weeks of office work, light gaming, and editing before I needed to do a full recharge. So after receiving the KE68 and using it for a couple of weeks, the pros I discovered that I really like are the build quality. It feels premium and elevates the look of my desktop. The multiple connections available, which make it so versatile, whether you want to use Wi-Fi or Bluetooth to connect to multiple devices like TVs, computers, your phone. The wide array of multimedia buttons, which do make my life easier at a tap of a button, whether editing or typing. Having a rechargeable battery that actually gives you a long time before it charges. The soft touch synthetic leather rest wrist is also comfortable and nice feeling for long computer sessions. The keys are relatively quiet, and feel good at the end of your fingers during typing. But what has to be the best thing and the reason you would buy this keyboard is the ergonomics. After a short period of adjustment to the ergonomic design, I found this keyboard and layout was extremely conducive to saving my wrists and hands from stress and fatigue. Of course, I'm still getting used to typing with the KE68, but as time goes on, I'm gonna get faster and become more natural with my typing. Even so much to say, it would be hard for me to go back 
to my original keyboard for everything but gaming. Cons or things I wish that could be improved on the KE68? Or I wish it had some backlit keys so it improved visibility. The volume controls and play stop buttons are in the middle of the keyboard, which is a little hard to get used to, but really any new product which goes against what you're used to does seem a little strange at first. So I'll probably get used to that. But all in all, so far my complaints are minor and can be overcome as I become more comfortable with the keyboard. So that was a look at the Jellycomb KE68 wireless ergonomic keyboard. This is a keyboard that I highly recommend for anybody who works long hours at their computer. As always, I'll leave a link down below if you want to pick one of these up for yourself. Also, if you have any questions or comments about this keyboard, don't forget to drop them down below too. Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and check out my other videos coming up right now. Thanks for watching. Thank you.